At least a dozen people were killed and dozens of others were wounded in the eastern Ukraine city Donetsk when a school and bus were both hit by shelling. CCTV's Stephanie Fried is in Donetsk with this update. This was the welcome back at the start of Donetsk city school year. A playground hit by shelling. Nearby, a civilian bus also hit at about the same time. The combined death toll from the two incidents, at least a dozen. Dozens of others wounded. Ukraine's army and armed opposition forces have been fighting for control of Donetsk International Airport for months. An official truce agreed upon by the two sides weeks ago should have put an end to that. But during the past days, battling has intensified, threatening to break apart any remnants of a ceasefire in eastern Ukraine. At Donetsk PS1 across town, children were starting the school year at the same time. They were aware of the blasts, but didn't know how bad it was. Both sides are blaming each other for Wednesday's carnage. One thing is clear. Assurances from Ukraine's President Petro Poroshenko that the worst of the East's fighting is over are not reassuring to the people living here. Stephanie Fried, CCTV, Donetsk, Ukraine.